We are going to tour this luxurious hostel rooms of IIT Delhi. Fuck, fuck, fuck! Look at this room, guys. It's A yes, seats. <laughs> look at that. We are also going to tour in the Royal IIT Delhi building, where successful CEOs come, the most futuristic lecture halls, mass restaurants, and much more. Starting with the best ever hostels that you'd ever live in the premium institutes of India. What is the maximum we had ever seen in IIT hostels? I am an alumni of IIT Madras. I've been to IIT Bombay. I watched the hostel rooms of IIT KGB Hyderabad. You know what? When IIT Madras had opened 146 crore hostels for the freshers, I thought. That is the best because it has a luxurious hostel room, high-speed internet, gyms, indoor badminton courts, basketball and volleyball courts inside hostel, vending machine, and much more. But you know what? The single most feature that destroys all the best hostels of IIT is IIT Delhi hostels have single private AC rooms. The hostels I'm talking about here is named as Ronagiri and Sabdagiri hostels. Let's have a look at it. Now you might be wondering why there's a girl inside boys hostel that too at night. Cause it's a co-ed hostel. Vidya <laughs> is going to show his room. Yep, yep. What the, the fuck? This hostel is completely AC. It's <laughs> air conditioned room, guys. What the fuck? Look at this room, guys. It's AC. It's... <laughs> Look at that. AC remote also. Is it an AC remote? No. Oh, bad, bad, bad. oh, there is no switch and all. There is no low budget things. <laughs> okay. They have a mirror. They have a nice book rack, advanced table. This room where you can actually see the Kulit Minar. You can't be able to find, but I will show you now. Now, if you thought this is cool, in the later parts of the video, we are going to explore the luxurious lecture halls, Royal IIT Delhi building, where extremely rich and successful people visit. And much more. By the way, if you're new here, my name is Raghuram Chandra Kumar. I'm an M.Tech alumni of IIT Madras. The reason I made this video is IIT Delhi just simply amazed me. Recently, Bill Gates came to IIT Delhi. IIT Delhi, not any other. IIT. Even Jack Dorsey, Mark Zuckerberg, they visit IIT Delhi campus. That's only. when I decided to check IIT Delhi campus, and IIT Delhi just simply amazed me. <laughs> Now, after my B.Tech, I traveled to Hyderabad for my GATE exam preparation. There was this one guy in our coaching center. He has n number of female friends. Literally, they are a group of total girls and one boy. And I don't like him. He makes me feel bad. He makes every one of my friends feel bad. So one day while I was coming to afternoon class after lunch, and that guy was actually my mess. Since he had 12 female friends, he often don't go to mess after. His female friends share their food or they order food in afternoon. So while I was coming to afternoon class, hey Raghu, what did you eat in the mess? I don't know. Didn't you eat in the mess? I ate, but I don't know what I ate. Guys, I'm looking for my ego. Did you see it? <laughs> every one of the girls off. But how is the food at IIT Delhi mess? Now in 2022, I went to participate in Inter IIT Sports Meet in Delhi. In 2023, I went to IIT Bombay for participate in Inter IIT Sports Meet. Needless to say, IIT Bombay food had to be better. <laughs> Now, what about the normal mess? You are a student at IIT Bombay. You've been staying at IIT Delhi, IIT Metro. Where do you think the best food is good? I think best food is at IIT Bombay only. <laughs> Madras food ka taste. I I think it's not according to my taste. Yeah, once Maggie was served, yeah, in breakfast, who serves Maggie in breakfast? Humiliation. Okay, fine. I understand everyone has their own taste. IIT Bombay mess food is good. Personally, I enjoy the mess food of IIT Madras too. Now a quick announcement. If you are looking for a quality coaching for GATE exam at an affordable price, I would recommend GATE Wala. And their courses are taught by experts in both Hindi and English. Batch details. Fresh at ESC plus GATE 2027 batch 9800. Parakram 2.0 GATE 2025 batch B and 7200. Vijay 2.0 GATE 2025 rank. improvement batch 5400 fresh at 2.0 gate 2020 batch at 9400 fresh at gate 2026 chemical batch b at 15999 parakram 2025 plus esc plus gate plus psc batch d at 15999 fresh at 2027 plus psu plus placement operation cs and it at 9800 parakram 2.0 gate plus psc plus placement operation 2025 batch c 999 gate is serious at 1000 rupees now experience infinite learning with pw which includes gate kasana pvq books all and all batches have live online classes from monday to friday practice sheets will be given for each topic with live discussion on the questions so doubt clearance will be there 24 by regular 7. tests will be conducted also pw has pvq booklet which covers topic wise set of question from the past 16 years with video so solution so why waiting for i have attached the link in the use code ragu 500 for additional discount and enroll for your gate exam preparation now when i was blogging the campus to find out what are the cool things are in iit delhi campus i saw one girl who was walking very seriously in her laptop but in a road i was like is it because there is a power cut in hostel so i decided to ask her that's when i came to know the speciality of
Windy. She told, this place is called Windy because it looks like a wind tunnel. I don't know. You're on your own, kid. Okay, wind tunnels just look like this. It is actually a device used to simulate wind flow to study the interaction between object and moving air. Thanks, Wikipedia. <laughs> the best part she told is it is a very active place because near to it we have academic building, we have library, we have CCD, and more than that, whenever there is a fest is going on, this place is one which is more and more active in IIT Delhi. But Raghu, why is she still studying in roads? <laughs> Guess what? The summers in IIT Delhi is pain because it goes around 50 degree temperature. But no matter what is the temperature in IIT Delhi, this place almost have a constant wind flow. If you look at IIT KGB, the campus area is 2,100 acres. Also, IIT KGB campus is three times the area of Vatican City and Monaco put together. IIT Kanpur campus is 1,055 acres. IIT Gauhati campus is 700 acres. Eight, 10 seconds later. But you know, IIT Delhi campus is the smallest out of all and it is 320 acres. But all these IITs have restriction in powered vehicles. We have to pedal cycles from one end to other end and it's pain. But IIT Delhi is just so different. I'm actually talking about Yulu. What? It's a nice feature, you know. There will be many Yulu spots inside the campus. Just like petrol, you need to recharge the amount in the Yulu app and you can use it. So is there any facility that is provided by IIT Delhi for transport for free of cost? Correct, correct. It is provided. We also have buses, a small van kind of a setup. For free transport in IIT Madras, we have us of AC buses. But I like Yulu, despite it is paid. Yes, buses usually come in 20 or 35 minutes interval. And we can't always use it when there was an emergency. What is the mode of free transport? Here? And here actually we have to do this e-rickshaw sort of thing. They take 10 rupees. Now, eating outside for Indians increased a lot. Stats from Statistica, which shows that at least one time a week, their respondents between 16 to 54 died. So, now. what are all the options we have in IIT Delhi? First one is something which has been recommended almost all the people I have met at IIT Delhi. Right now, we are going for lunch. Sanjay, I asked Sanjay, like, where, where we can get the cheap and best. So, where we are going right now? We are going for Raj Dandi restaurant. Yeah, we'll be counting stars. I see this light like a swinging vine Swing my heart across the line And my face is flashing signs Seek it out and ye shall find the old But I'm not that old young But I'm not that bold I don't think Inside it, there will be a hotel, chat shop, you have a bakery, a vending machine. Plus, there is a chaios inside it. And this is the food court where I met Shwakat, if you don't know about him. <laughs> so, this guy posted a harsh reply to one of my video. But two months back, I made one video, honest review of MTech at IIT Madras, and he made a paragraph long hate message. That is the biggest hate message I have ever seen in my history. And I replied with a very big one. And he recognized me in IIT Delhi and we become friends. Hate turned friendship story. And the next food course is, I don't have to say it, because you already know it. Every campus tour, you click. This is the place I have to ignore from the next video because this is universal. It's CCD. The best thing about CCD here at IIT Delhi is it opens 24 by 7. And the next food place which most often many people come and love to eat is a set of candies which lie just below the library. It will be present till midnight. Now apart from that there are many night candies are there in IIT Delhi which will operate only at night from 9pm to 5am in the morning. But things are changing now. It was found that average Indian orders food 4.2 times a month over dining out in restaurants 3.7 times a month. In other words, we Indians prefer to dine in over dining dining out. In IIT Bombay, when I have visited Rushi, Rushi ordered food. The Frankie I ate, there is simply taste. And here at IIT Tretras, we have Vistara food court, we have Zaitun accepts order online. Now the bigger question is, is there any restaurants deliver food to your hostels at IIT Delhi? Yeah, yeah, yeah. that is there. Uh, we have 4-5 outlets there. There's a thing called Ishtara. Uh, who when you about watched a video in YouTube which says I rejected IIT to join this college. Just ignore that. Did you know every year there will be approximately 3 to 5 crore budget for inter IT sports? In my life, I have never ever played a grand tournament like Just that. like inter IIT, there will be also an inter IIT cultural meet that will happen every year. Where students from different IITs will compete in different cultural events. And more than that, there are so much advanced projects where the students are getting crores of funding to develop it. IITs are the IITs. From helping you to shine in tech, entrepreneurship, 
entrepreneurship sport in the best possible way iits are premium no institutes can replace that so definitely your every second of working hard for iit is worth now in the academic year when i went for inter iit sports in delhi the same year the inter iit cultural meet was happened in iit madras from 9th to 11th january so dushyan who is an iit delhi basketball player he actually came to iit madras for participating in one of the cultural event while the conversation was going on with dushyan he says ragu you know in iit delhi there will be some happenings here and there and the campus will be active but here in iit madras the campus is not active that much every iit if you take there will be four main first one is cultural first one is technical first one is entrepreneurship and the other is a sports first and all these first are available in almost all iits but the speciality of iit delhi is iit delhi has more number of first than any other iit right now a fest going on which is called trist which is the one of the biggest tech fest of the north india we have a separate fest for nss okay we have a separate okay. fest for every department we have a separate fest for every club as well placement cell has their own fest even in their sports fest also they do stand up arts and make it big and usually what excites all of us is the cultural fest is it right? so if we take just the cultural fest iit bombay cultural fest aka moon indi cup which is the biggest in fact the biggest cultural fest in asia and in iit madras the sarang fest is also big at the artist or not that biggest iit bombay and the pro nights is also big so just below iit bombay cultural fest above all the iit cultural fest lies the rand hours is it rand hours i don't know <laughs> the biggest cultural fest of iit delhi lies now i don't know for some reason the best ceos in the world come and wish just iit delhi not iit bombay not iit madras hi ma hey. uh, myself alki jain so my question is very simple why are you showing so much interest in india answer honestly be it mark zuckerberg jack dose or bill gates they visit iit delhi and i don't know why but what i do know is these historical moments do happen inside this iit delhi main building so what is inside this main building inside the main building is where iit delhi director office is present it has barn hall and sanjay told this is where the main events with guest speakers used to happen and you know the roof of dogra hall it is actually a hyperbolic parabola you boss it has been designed to be supported only at the there are no supporting structure in the middle of the structure Now just behind the iit delhi main building lies the library of iit delhi but based on the observation what i feel is out of all the library the library in iit bombay is the best not simply because that library is the luxurious and spacious also the infrastructure of iit bombay library is very good even they have a special canteen It's so cool. I just liked it. Now there is an interesting stat. Many Indians on average spend about three years, fourteen minutes on social media every day. According to your stats by W, average lifespan of human beings is seventy three point four years. So let's assume you start using social media by the age ten. Then throughout the end of your years, you might spend around six years on social media. So as the saying goes, quit social media. Quit social media. Quit social media. Fully cut off from uh, social media. And if you feel you find it difficult in controlling it, reducing social media use is actually a sign. You can check out my free ebook, Three Hacks in Two Minutes to Increase Your Study Session Way Better, in my Telegram link in the description. How is the internet speed at IIT Delhi? Or simply, why not we compare the internet speeds of IIT Delhi, IIT Bombay, and IIT? Madras? Firstly, IIT Madras. Download speed is 90 Mbps. Upload speed is 90 Mbps. Now IIT Bombay. Download speed is 142 Mbps. Upload speed is 120 Mbps. Now IIT Delhi. It just literally Blue my mind. It's around 250 Mbps. Now, how many of you here watched the movie called Sichore? Where the story revolves around the Inter Hostel Championships at IIT. It is so emotional, but actually that is not the main emotion behind the sports grounds at IIT. Firstly, in Sichore, the tournament that was shown was Inter Hostel tournament. Other side and the main emotion behind these sports grounds is, I strongly believe at least, Inter IIT. Long back when the first five IITs was established in the year 1961, IIT Bombay hosted the first ever Inter IIT Sports Meet. Now, if you join IIT and if you are also a sport player, the emotions, the intensity of practice for Inter IIT will be limitless. You might be thinking IITs will play or not? They play morning two to three hours, evening three to four hours. Emotions will be so high. There will be intense fight that will happen at Inter IITs also. Now, what are the sports facilities at IIT Delhi and the grounds at IIT Delhi?
Now, if you are like me, I born in a lower middle class family. That small home is there, right? That is actually my house. I never even had an opportunity to study in any luxurious college. And I joined IIT Madras for MTech, and I didn't had a chance to attend any classes at IIT because I joined during COVID. Okay. The way we do this. Even though I miss the adventure of studying in a classroom, I actually doesn't regret it. But had it, I been a student of IIT Delhi, I would definitely have the regret of not attending the classrooms at IIT. Will you ever feel that you were studying in an Indian college? I've been a student of IIT Madras and I explored every luxurious building in IIT Madras. Even I've been to IIT Bombay. But this lecture hall out there is what I call as luxury. Could I, could I, could I, Now recently I read a book called Diary of the CEO. The author is a multi-millionaire CEO and popularly known through his podcast, The Diary of the CEO. He had been very successful in his life, but there is one problem in it. When he started out his career, he was so afraid of giving speeches in public because he had a limiting belief that I can be able to speak in stages. But you know what? No matter what, he always pushes him to take every opportunity to speak on stage. Fast forwarding to 10 years later, he had completely overcome his limiting belief. And he was one of the successful speaker of all. So stop telling yourself you are not qualified good enough or worthy. Growth happens when you start doing the things you are not qualified to do. If you dream of IIT, you can do it. Don't let that one spark of failure demotivates you. In fact, don't let that stream of failures demotivate you. Instead, every time you fail, analyze why you have failed. Prevent that mistake again. It will be much better and shine in your life. Now, in this video, we had noticed 10 cool features and I tried to give a context with analyzing it with IIT Bombay and IIT Madras. But I missed a couple of things. I haven't actually compared the best hostels of IIT Bombay with the best hostels of IIT Delhi. And the truth be told, if I I had one more life. I also love to study in IIT Bombay Best Hostel. Why? How does the Best Hostel of IIT Bombay looks like? Also, if you are wondering what will be the 10 most cool things of IIT Bombay, check out IIT Bombay campus store here. Bye. But I see the light from far away. It's down the line. Maybe I should not give up without a fight. Cause there will be a time.